Hey guys, how's it going? So when I first played this new update, I briefly tried out the new difficulty, Lion Slayer. But I didn't get a full run, because I died pretty quickly. Today, I'm gonna actually try to get a full run and see if I can get a victory. See, this is already a level 4 fight, this is already level 3. Who's this? Criminal. That's the thing, normally you're fighting criminals and civilians in the first week. So I'm gonna take this fight, since it is level 1. Might as well take the easy fights when I can. This guy's got no shield, he's got a torch. Alright, so shouldn't be too hard to get hits on him. He doesn't have a helmet, so that's good. Nice. Slaver Club's not a weapon I use a lot, but it's not a bad weapon to get your hands on early because it's got a lot of damage. It's not too bad to swing with. You do have to get pretty close with it for like a two-handed weapon, but... At the start, when your enemies aren't too dangerous, that's not too bad. There we go, nice and easy. I am gonna want... So the thing is, I'm getting fewer rewards than normal, but I almost want to try to get armor sooner than normal, because the 1.5 times damage, that's a lot, you know? I took that easy 1v1, and now my 1v1s are up to level 6 already. Mired in Man at Arms in week 2, that's crazy. Oh, that's interesting. So I've used, like, a bigger two-handed loop, but then there's also a one-handed. I didn't know that. And they actually do really good damage, these loots. The two-hander, and now... We got the damage on this one. But that's not great. Oh, here's another one. Ooh. Yeah, okay, those rusty two-handers are always dangerous. 28 damage. Hits that wouldn't be too big, normally are now pretty big. The name of the game is going to be avoiding damage more so than doing damage. Because the thing is, 25 extra health for the enemies? Like, that can be a lot too. You know, right now I'm doing about like 12 damage a hit, so that's like two, maybe even three extra hits I need to get on these guys to kill them. But, you know, that's, that's more doable. Whereas like, if these guys are hitting me for, you know, 30 damage, with a rusty sword. I can only take a few of those hits, you know? 20 damage with the flathead. And you know, these aren't even good weapons that they're using now. Ah, uh, yeah, okay, I need to heal here. Healing is also going to be really important. Can't really go into fights with less than max health. Ooh. Yeah, okay, so every hit I take pretty much is going to be pretty big is not good and like i'm definitely noticing the extra health on these guys they die a lot slower than they did before and that's gonna get better as i get better weapons as well this tradic is not bad obviously but i think now like if you're playing on lion slayer you're really gonna want to get your hands on you know something like triumph a uh, bardiche a Feradaka, like something that can just really do a lot of damage. A Bronze Talisdaka would also be pretty good. Although I don't even know. The rackets might be getting so high here that it wouldn't even be that good. I don't think I'm going to buy another weapon right now just because this Tradaka will serve me like for a while. You know, it'll be good to have a little bit of protection. Um, even if it's not the biggest shield, not a shield that I would typically use. Could help me out a little bit. There we go. Doing its job. Okay, I missed. I missed on that one. Oh my gosh. I'm lucky that wasn't a bigger hit. Alright, one of these guys needs to die here. There we go. This guy must be low. Right? Crap. There we go, all right. See what I mean? If you watch the video about throwing, you just never know if you're gonna actually hit the guy, hit his shield. You know, just better to go in for a regular hit there. A spear wouldn't be bad at all. A spear would be pretty good because that's gonna allow me to keep my distance. The thing about a spear, like, it really lets you, lets you keep your distance and then you can really just go in for an attack when it's safe, you know? Like, this guy's not doing anything here, I'll go for an attack. 
Still not doing anything. Go for an attack. Now I'll back off and wait. There we go. Nice. He doesn't have a big shield, so I don't have to do anything special here. Just stab straight up over it. Okay, max HP. That'll do nicely. Okay, 45% discount in the shop, so I don't have much money here, but I want to buy something if I can. Okay, many versus many at the small pit. Not ideal. This Okay, these are paying the same, so I might as well take fewer guys. But I should be fine, because this is an ideal matchup. Spear against two-handers. There we go. Alright. This is 34 on my right arm, which isn't protected by my shield, so I can get this. This guy's shield is a little more of a problem. Oh, man. Yeah, I'm gonna have to get my hands on a bigger shield. Okay. He's gonna drop it completely, then I'll take it. Now I should be in good shape for the rest of this fight, because this guy's shield broke. He also had an oval shield. And this guy's got a two-hander. Oh. All right. Not too bad, I didn't lose too much health. That's good. You know, that could be another problem playing on Lion Slayer. If you keep taking a bunch of damage and then, you know, fall into the trap of having to heal all the time, spending all your money on healing, that can make the game really tough when that happens. I think I'll buy this too, because 45% is decent. It's cheap enough as well. And now I'm pretty well protected. You know, my legs aren't really, but I'm just gonna kind of live and die with that, as always. Uh, oh, okay, so this guy... This guy's wearing the Leather Lafosi armor, too. So that's cool. I thought, you know, that would make sense for Lafosi warriors to wear this stuff. Ooh, 39 damage. Nice. I guess I'm okay for now. A shield would be good, though. The Great Chaco would also be really cool. 34 damage. That's the kind of damage I want, you know? I think maybe I'll order shields. I think sturdy shields would be good. I'm definitely feeling the stamina regen a little bit. It's gonna be tough here to keep myself armored enough, but then also have any stamina. Ah, man, my helmet broke. Okay, the uh, sturdy shields, that maybe wasn't the move. Oh, well, there you go. All right, it's a lot of dudes. Oh, that was an avoidable hit. I just did not lift my shield. There we go. Can't afford to get lazy with the shield. Whoa, all right. That complicates things. Okay, what do we have left? This guy's got a sword, this guy's got an axe. Get rid of sword boy first. There we go. All right, that got a little bit close. I need to pay for healing. And I'm going to try to get something really easy here. Well, my health's not too low, so even if this guy hits me for like a 50 with the uh, Aradaka, I'll be able to survive it. On one hand, I wanna see like what kind of numbers these guys can hit with some of the better weapons in the game. And then at the same time, I really don't wanna find out be very bad for me if I found out. Well, there you go. 30's not so crazy, though. I can hit that in the regular mode. Nice. Oh, man. I gotta, I gotta try to avoid going in for attacks, like, when he's going in for them. So you never know what's gonna happen when that happens. Hmm. Oh, goodness. I feel like I need one more hit here. Alright. Uh, I wish this was spoils. It's not, right? What do they have? They have 
Ah, they both have the flail. That's not what I like to see, because flails are kind of hard to block. Yeah, okay, my shield just took 39 damage twice. Now I took 31. Ah, there it goes. Ooh, okay, nice. That was a good hit. I picked his shield up just to have something, but really I'm going to be relying on dodging here because I don't trust myself to block a flail with this shield. There we go, that worked. I might even pick up that flail now. Or not. Alright. That was pretty good in the end. Took one big hit again. If I can limit myself to one big hit, then I should be fine. Uh, okay, so we got a Bardish. 48 damage. What a ridiculous number that is. Uh, I want that bad, so I'm gonna hold that. Plate. Okay, so yeah, my shield's gone. This could be dicey. I don't know. We'll see. Because he's either got a Bardish or he's got a tower shield and a sword. He's got he's got a Bard. He's got he's got a Bardish. Okay. Well, I better not get hit. This one might be over with if I get hit. He's got a lot of armor too. Little two-hander battle, though. You'll have to see it. Oh, boy. Oh, okay. Oh, man, 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 man. Yep. Okay, and my weapon's gonna go already. I thought I was actually gonna be able to last a little bit longer. Okay, no helmet, that's good. Oh my gosh, alright. That was kind of scary. Because you see my health bar pretty much. Each, each hit pretty much took like a third of my health, so... One more would have been cutting things really close. Ooh, but it's uh, on discount, so it actually is enough. Uh, okay, that's not good either, though. My chest broke. So that's another thing that... I kind of didn't consider. The enemies having more damage and more health means that's going to be tougher on your weapon durability, because you have to hit them more times, and on your armor, because uh, they're just doing more damage when they hit your armor, your shield. So not having armor at this point of the run on Lion Slayer is a bit of a tough predicament. And then I can't afford the male shirt. Yes, I can. There we go. Uh, I think I'm week 14, so I must be getting pretty close to Aspired. It's interesting now because, like... Oh, oh my gosh, 57 damage. Jeez. Okay, so I can't get hit again because it's going to kill me. Holy cow. So what I was saying is, like, with, a, with the Professional Aspirant before... You would kind of get to Aspired before you really got to fighting the top tier enemies, right? Whereas now... I'm not even there yet, and I'm fighting... What's this? Professional Aspirant. So, it's not quite the top tier, but it's pretty darn close. So, that's the thing. It's like, the Lion Slayer is not just going to make the fights themselves harder. Makes the management harder, like, I'm, I'm definitely feeling, you know, a little bit short on money. Oh, gosh. A little short on money. Um, it's going to make some of the win conditions a lot harder, like... You know, whichever one it is, slave or criminal, when you need to amass fame. Um, soldier, to amass 100,000 gold, is not going to be easy. There we go. So what do I need here? Like one more fight? Probably. Canyon commander. Alright. I can do a commander. Yeah, okay.
Nice. All right, that was pretty easy. Is that enough? Yes, sir. Not too tough, but definitely got pretty close a few times. <laughs>